Hello there. I'm Scott Forsyth, the VAPI historian. Today I'm going to take you on a little tour of Antietam Battlefield. Right here we have the cornfield. It's uh, infamous for much of the beginning of the battle, and much, much life has been lost there. I'm going to take you on a little driving tour. I've lost count of how many investigations I've done because I do a lot of this kind of stuff. But uh, I use an alternative method of summoning the spirits. I try through this feel. I use music. After the bloody morning at the cornfield, the Union pushed down to the West Woods right here, where they're surrounded by Confederates. They got massacred right here. Pretty bad. The evening is coming upon us. Now we'll be against the federal government by being in the park at dark. So I gotta hurry. It's a recurring theme here on these battlefields. The federal government's always coming to get you. Here I am walking down the sunken road. Yankee Doodle went to town a riding on a pony. As you can see, it's very scenic here. But uh, soon the federal police are going to come park police, and uh, once the sun goes down, then I'm going to have to be chased by them. Before it gets dark, I'll take you on a quick tour of Bloody Lane Trail. I think a good way of summoning the spirits is to reenact the situation. Right now, I'm a Union soldier storming the Bloody Lane. <laughs> I didn't see any ghosts. Maybe I caught one on camera. One thing I do know, somebody saw me. Some bikers down there, probably wondering what I'm doing. The infamous Dunker Church. Let's go take a look. This was used for hospitals during the battle. I'm kind of scared to go in here. But uh, not, not much usually goes on in, in these places. So, they're very shy. Ah! My favorite investigation was way before the days of VAPI. Out in Missouri, when I lived in Whiteman Air Force Base, a group of us, we went to a, to a, a cemetery similar to this. And uh, while some of the guys were out investigating, I was sitting at a vehicle, at my vehicle, just like this, because I didn't feel like squishing my feet into graves. And uh, as I was sitting here, something happened. While I was sitting on the vehicle, I heard a distinct sound. It sounded like a creaking door opening. And then it was very dark. So because it was very dark, I saw something out of the corner of my eye. It was a flash of light that went down into a specific grave from the top of a tree. And there were birds rustling. It was pretty cool. First ghost hunting crew in Missouri the federal government sent us to different places because we're in the Air Force. But ever since then, I've been very curious. And that's what spurred Texas Jeff and I to talk about the creation of VAPI out in the desert. 